Every time I play Ming Ming, though, it's just... It feels terrible. But we, we can not play the Crash Fist board. So, like... I know I said not get baited by garbage, but should I lock Realm Killing Palms? I kind of don't want to. I kind of want to just try this button. I'm going to pretend this isn't here. I'm just going to pretend it's not there. Yes, I'm not doing it. I'm pretending it's not there. We'll, we'll just draw a Realm Killing Palms, don't worry. It will just be in the Omen anyway. I'm gonna keep all these crappy Crash Fists. My plan this time is to re-roll for any of the fates that interact with Physique, basically. So, Regenerating Body being the best, Firmness of Body being the worst, Physique Master being kind of in the middle. Physique Master is good on tiers 2 and 4, right? Because on tier 3 you can take his tier 3 and it's a wash. Plants, 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 obviously. That's a good prediction, Ben, because if the game goes long enough, that is an inevitability. That is just something that is guaranteed to happen. Yeah, if you stack them, like, it's good too. But I I'm thinking more like things like Solid Foundation are probably, like, too good to pass up for the most part. But they, they are good to stack, I agree. I don't know why I put this exercise fists in three. Anyone know why I did that? Doesn't really make sense there. I'm sure I'm dying on like turn four a lot. That one. Cool mechanic. I can upgrade this exercise fist. I even got my exchange back. Beautiful. Life is good. Alright, now we're making good physique. Ideally, we find Regenerating Body on 3 again, and then I can just eat all of my Physique cards bar 1. Almost. Regen body instead of Ming. I don't know if that's a good idea, but I respect it. Tendies is upgraded. One, two, three. Four, five, six. I do want to play one of these. I'm gonna keep all of this stuff, I think. Obviously my opponent has a uh, regenerating body as well. This is just the world we live in. Every Tilquay has regenerating body at every tail. I 
I completely miscounted how much physique I was getting. That's okay. <laughs> Sometimes you have to completely miscount how much physique you're getting. That's part of the two quay difference. Look, this man does not know how to count. He, he, he simply, it's simply beyond him. If you're good at counting, you don't learn to lift boulders, if you know what I'm saying. So this is okay, but it's not great. It's... I don't even really know it's that much better than Courage to fight. I think I just refresh it. I mean, it's good. It's, it's fine. Which doesn't really do very much by itself. It's fine. Eh. Well, regrets. This is Wes. Didn't have time to think about my turn. <laughs> I think Firmness of Body is worse. I think Physique Master is better. Firmness of Body, the healing is just so minor. It's like two Physique and like two health, right? Uh, at the end of the game, it's like two Physique and like six health. I don't know, I think Physique Master is probably better. The, the numbers on Firmness of Body is really bad, but I could be underrating it. Right, I'm gonna start getting rid of some of these cards here. I've drawn way more palms this game than the last game where I took mega palms. So, good for thought, I guess. Do I upgrade a tendons? I guess if I'm playing two tendons, I may as well upgrade them and then I'll roll them away later. Turn two side. Max of turn every two periods. So are you thinking I should have taken Meteor Quench then? Because Meteor Quench was definitely a consideration to the that I didn't really talk about. Why are you hanging around here? Kinda of sounds like you're doing it, Hesloth. The subdued dragon is here. I like where this guy's at. Something we can all aspire to. If I do draw a uh, crash this card, we can run this. It's pretty good. Yeah, solid as a board. I don't think I don't have the damage to deal with what this guy is uh, putting out there. Just a very, very tough board to deal with. But he hasn't been hashtag deck thinning like I have. So, you know, who's the real winner here?
Plus, the solid foundation difference. Okay, this physique master is good. This lets me break through a whole turn earlier. Regen body, solid foundation, body building. Hmm. Yeah, I, I can respect that. I, I am by no means an expert or even competent, so definitely uh, open to the feedback. Cheek corrupting sunflower now. It's cute. The rest of the shit doesn't do anything, I think. <laughs> I just gotta marry. I guess I do need to roll a bit on three here. Oh, on four a bit, sorry. Whatever tier I'm on. Whatever this tier is, I'll need to do some rolling. Crash Fists? That's not fair. You're not allowed to play Crash Fists. What is this? It's Bush Week or something? Come on, man. Palms only. Not Fists. Wow. Okay, so now this makes four physique plus regenerating body, which means I don't need the sparing the load anymore. Okay, so speaking of Bushwick, I should probably play in these crash fists. It's Bushwick time. Is it Chi Corrupting Sunflower time as well? Always down to corrupt some sunflowers. Maybe this should be palms in two. She does have a lot more chi this time, so I'm a little wary of this sunflower doing anything. Okay, it turns out the sunflower did jack shit, but you know, it was fun to play for a time. Maybe this time it'll do something. Okay, you know, it, it bought us a turn. Was that worth a card? I don't think so. <laughs> yeah. They need more bones. So let's tap that one. Am I... Do I have another horse palms? I had another horse palms here somewhere. It's fine. Let's cut this card. Let's see. One, two, three. One, two, one, 
All right, we break through this turn, and then we start trying to find our uh, our big physique payoffs. I have one stack of regenerating body, and I have a little bit of extra physique and physique master and firmness of body. So these are nice things to have. I wasn't expecting an unrestrained sword one to come out then, but I guess I don't know what I was expecting. You just always expect an unrestrained sword one to come out of your opponent's board. You could be fighting Wutsa, and you should expect an unrestrained sword one to come out of her board at this stage, I think. Hold on to this uh, internal injury board if we can. Hell, maybe we'll just play it. Maybe we'll just play it. Ghost Howling kind of wants to be on there, but kind of can't fit it right now. again? Alright, that'll, that'll be the last one of the day then, I think. It's a pretty good version of this board at the moment. I don't know what Charlie's so excited about, but he sure is excited about something. Physique falls behind a little bit, but I think that's okay. It's a pretty minor issue to solve itself fairly quickly. Yeah, I can't see. That is one evil flower. Hard bamboo is here. Nice to have you aboard. Hard bamboo. A little stun locked. Double line is good. I'm just upgrading the marrow. This is just going to go into realm killing palms if I want to get off this board. Am I gonna have too many cards in my hand? Maybe. I think I'm supposed to be weakening her, but she might be weakening me, so maybe it doesn't matter.
Yeah. Whoops. These things happen. Got up. That's not fair. Man who's playing by none of the rules complains. That's not fair. <laughs> All right, we make most of our physique this round too, which is nice. I will eventually draw all my exercise souls. So I'm a little tempted to take this crane footwork, but I think I should just take an extra one and probably even upgrade it because at the moment I'm not even playing them. Too full. Let's just spare ourselves this card. Fortune teller Ming Ming feels like a meme. Yes, I agree. <laughs> Fun meme there. But yeah, I've not been super impressed with it. Alright, we draw one more plant watering. We draw one more plant watering, and then uh we have two evil vines. We have a bunch of exercise souls coming. We have our space spirit field. We have a pretty good internal injury board at the moment. With room for a lot of upgrades. We've already got the Max Marrow. It's a lot a lot to be happy about right now. We're making all our physique. Yeah, that doesn't really do anything. Our world looks a lot better than this Tukwe. Not, 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 not a happy fellow. Yeah, Sonic, I kind of agree. Her, her mid game's a little bit too rough for it. I don't need more marrows. Let's roll one. Oh, I just <laughs> drew an evil vine. Beautiful. Simply beautiful. I don't know if I win this fight. This board looks a bit scary. Bunch of inch forces. The weaken might not really do anything. It could be another sure roar instead. I don't really love that though. You could also just turn around and like soul cleaving me. The board has now got an extra chase in it with this turn. Yeah, I want to do this. One, two, three. I mean, it doesn't matter, right? I think that's better, actually. Get the full weaken off of the soul cleaving. As a uh, maxed gather intense force. Is that something to be concerned about? He's wasting a ton of that force though on his uh, physique attacks. Alright, 
he's just dead here. Very good, very good. This deck's humming along. Okay. Jesus, did you see those drawers, chat? <laughs> you know. Just, just your regular double blood loader straw, you know. Just normal stuff. I haven't drawn many of my uh, souls yet. But we'll, we'll draw them in time. I have to eat some cards. Reishi kind of sucks. I don't think I'm double blood lotusing. So I can eat that. The question is, I think, do I vine her? And I think the answer is no. I mean, maybe it's yes because vine is just a. Oh, I should just combine them, huh? Oh, whatever. Yeah, you should have played the physique card before the Gather Force. This kind of sucks on second cycle, actually. Yeah, I know, yeah, Panther, I, I often have the same problem. <laughs> I very much have the same problem. So this means I do get to Soul Cleaving Weaken onto her. Which is probably not good for her. This is a lot of, uh, not payoff. She almost got there. Sorry, Wutzer. You picked the wrong broken build. Sorry, sure, I don't need seven of you. How are we doing on this cleaving situation? 86? So after this turn, I have enough physique for uh, the Realm Killing Palms to pop off. Sort of want these separate, normally. I don't want to use a Dao fruit to upgrade one of these cards, but maybe I don't need to. Oh, Jesus. Just headbutted the shit out of me. So excited. One more card, probably. Two more cards. Yikes. I think I might not draw cards next turn. <laughs> I think I draw too many plant cards. It'd be actually really bad if I don't draw plant cards, because it means I won't draw an exercise soul. So that could be a problem. Might die to this realm killing palms. Not quiet. This is Persona 4. 
Okay, I did draw cards. That's good. I drew an exercise fist. Delightful. So, I can run the, uh, so I guess neither of these people do I want Lotus, right? Maybe eating mushrooms, because I'm an idiot. Are you happy now? So I can run the RKP line, I have enough physique. I sort of want one more exercise soul, right? Um, three exercise souls, two realm killing palms. But I don't know how you play the mirror. Time for double devouring, yeah. I really want to 100% it though. I guess I could just run regular vine. <laughs> but I'm giving both of these two equates a bunch of attack downs working really well at the moment. Bones, can you piss off? The Reishi that never was. This is the guy I just beat, and he's not even necessarily aware that I beat him, so I don't really feel like there's much urgency in doing anything at the moment. Could have had another attack down. Ah, oh, whoops. I'm lucky. I don't really want this card against him, I think. And I don't need more crane footworks. Actually, why don't I eat the crane footwork? I do need more crane footworks. Because I'm not playing Sticks Agility on my end board. What if I played a single turn right next game? Do you think that would be good? To play a single turn correctly? I've done kind of a bad job drawing my exercise souls, despite taking one in an omen. Oh, you're also sure roaring me? <laughs> That's interesting. What does that mean? Entangled? More debuffs for sure, or... Actually, a really, really good entangle. It entangles me for two turns. And then you have your own soul cleaving. No? Okay. And that does kill me. Okay. Alright, what board's better? We have to pop this now. Double vine. What's better? Oh, 
The water I want to run is like this. But without this, obviously. Oh shit. I ran out of, <laughs> I ran out of clicks. <laughs> Sorry, I'm Fosto. Lose paragraph hexproof. <laughs> I mean, double vine's gonna be hard to beat, right? Extremely obnoxious. Yeah, just two bros flexing at each other. It's the same thing as who has the most great waves. I have no fucking clue, man. <laughs> I just seem to be winning. Hooray! Hooray! <laughs> we did it. We won a lobby.